Hello all. In one of my previous videos about rainbow tables and how they can be used to crack passwords, some of you have asked me what are reduction functions and whether I can give a concrete example for such. So in this video, I want to give you an easy example of how a reduction function could look like, but there are many reduction functions and you can create your own. So let me give you one easy example here. Let's say you start off with a password guess according to the instruction of the other video, in this case, password123, and apply a hashing algorithm on it. In this case, chart 256, which results in this 256 bit hash value. Now you need to apply a reduction function. A reduction function reduces this hash value to a new potential password in the chain. For example, you could choose the first four characters here, EF92, and convert them into ASCII using an online converter. So E, for example, converts into 101, F into 102, 9 into 52, and 2 into 50. Now it is up to you what you want to do with these numbers. You can sum these up, for example, which results in 310. So this is the value you can take to do anything you like to create the new potential password in the chain. Yeah, let's say you appended to the string password. So what you get is password 310. And you repeat the same process again. You, you apply the hashing algorithm on it. You get some uh, hash value, whatever it is, and then you apply again the reduction function. And that's it. This is how you create your chain of hashing values, potential passwords, and reduction function values. I hope this helped you.